Have you ever heard that 80% of the information that you convey comes not from your words, but from your gestures, facial expressions, and all nonverbal signals? In this video, you will learn five most powerful tips that will make your gestures world class, not just during the public speaking, but also during your everyday conversations with your friends, relatives, or colleagues at work. So tip number one, make your gestures broad. This is a broad gesture when the hand comes from here to there and the angle at the end of the gesture is more than 90 degrees. When you make your gestures broad, then you appear as a confident person and as a sincere person. People like broad gestures. So compare it to the smaller gestures which are close to your body and compare how the person appears that does broad gestures and the person that does smaller gestures. Tip number two, make your gestures slow and smooth. Slow and smooth. Uh, these gestures are slow and smooth and for example, these gestures are not as, as smooth. And sometimes people do gestures like this and they appear as aggressive and not confident at all times. Tip number three, vary your gestures. Even if your gestures are great, they are slow and smooth, but you're gesturing for a long, long time with the same gestures. People will get bored and they will stop listening to you and will start thinking about their other course or problems or ideas. So if you want to keep attention of people, keep your gestures varied. Sometimes do gesture with one hand, sometimes do, do gestures with two hands, sometimes do the best gesture that you can ever do, don't gesture at all. So for example, when you're talking, you gesture with one hand, with two hands, and don't gesture at all. Tip number four, illustrate a point in your story and in your message with your gestures. For example, several years ago, I moved from California to Tennessee, and in Tennessee, in our house there was a basement and above this basement there are two floors and on the second floor lived I and there is here is a big window on my floor this is how you can illustrate something in your story tip number five and perhaps one of the most important ones is that your gesture should be congruent with your message and with your emotions if you are very emotional but your gestures are small you appear as not sincere if you're not emotional but your gestures are really big then you appear also as not a very sincere person. The gesture should be congruent with your message. And the best way you can gesture, stop thinking about gesture, gesturing and never rehearse them. Gestures should be natural and sh they should not be rehearsed. So remember these five tips and your gestures will become much, much better today. And I want to end this video with the final and most important tip. Remember, the best gestures are facial expressions. So what your face says is much more important than what your body says. If you like this video, click like, press subscribe. I'm looking forward to see you in all my other videos.